dynamic and productive eras of human space exploration will come to a close as NASA flies out the remaining space shuttle missions to complete construction of the International Space Station, one of the world's most amazing engineering accomplishments and one that will serve as a test bed for new scientific discoveries. Now, our nation prepares to embark on a bold new journey to send humans to new destinations with a multi-purpose crew vehicle. Lockheed Martin leads the industry team developing the Orion Crew Exploration Vehicle, the nation's next generation state-of-the-art human spaceflight system capable of multiple missions to a variety of interplanetary destinations. The spacecraft is slated to launch into orbit for its initial test flight in 2013. After being proven safe and reliable, Orion will set out into the cosmos to take humans to destinations never explored before, such as asteroids, Lagrange points, and other deep space expeditions that will put us on an affordable and sustainable path to Mars. For more than 50 years, Lockheed Martin has been building spacecraft to withstand the extreme demands of launch and re-entry environments. And safety is always our primary concern. In fact, many of Orion's motors and systems have already been tested and validated to ensure optimal crew safety. The most significant test performed last year was Pad Abort 1 a flight test of Orion's launch abort system. The test, performed in New Mexico and simulated using Lockheed Martin investment hardware and software, was 100% successful. The abort system worked flawlessly as its 500,000 pounds of thrust propelled the test spacecraft a mile up and a mile away from danger allowing it to parachute safely back to Earth. Visual confirmation of landing. Another significant milestone is completion of the first Orion ground test vehicle, which was built at NASA's Michoud Assembly Facility in New Orleans, Louisiana, and shipped to Lockheed Martin's Denver facilities to be integrated with thermal protection systems prior to testing. This vehicle will be subjected to rigorous thermal testing, vacuum chamber tests, and every possible extreme environment and condition it will encounter during launch, spaceflight, and re-entry. These performance tests will prove out the design and integrity of the spacecraft. As proof of our commitment to the future of United States spaceflight, Lockheed Martin has built a state-of-the-art facility to develop and test spacecraft rendezvous and docking missions from concept to flight vehicles. The Space Operations Simulation Center in Denver, Colorado provides an ultra-stable test environment for precision instruments and accurate navigation systems used in space vehicles. The development, evaluation, and testing of these elements are necessary requirements to ensure success of human and robotic missions to Earth orbiting platforms, planets, moons, and other bodies in our solar system. The center also tests systems for ranging, rendezvous, docking, proximity operations, imaging, descent, and landing systems. As we venture further into space, this facility will provide the foundation of a capability to reduce the risks inherent in space travel. Using complex simulation models, the Space Operations Simulation Center team will be able to verify Orion's capability to take astronauts to the International Space Station, the Moon, asteroids, Mars, and beyond. Referred to as stepping stones, this proposed plan for space exploration introduces a series of increasingly challenging exploration missions that build incrementally and affordably towards America's long-term goal of exploring Mars. Each mission to the moon, 
distant asteroids, and finally to the moons of Mars, will develop technologies and demonstrate new capabilities. At each destination, astronauts will address key science objectives relating to the formation of the solar system and the origins of life. Joint telerobotic and human exploration missions can greatly expand our scientific understanding of distant worlds. Astronauts in orbit can control rovers on the surface of planets to collect samples from locations of possible biological interests. A mission to Mars could be undertaken as soon as 2030. Upon their safe return from the journey of a lifetime, the astronauts will return to the safe hands of NASA ground crews. Similar to Apollo, the astronauts will land in water and be retrieved. Orion has already tested many of these operations. The success of crew return methods is folded back into the design as the team prepares for production and assembly. Lockheed Martin brings premier human spaceflight and space exploration expertise in the development of this next generation crew space transportation system. Our collective expertise in large-scale systems integration, planetary exploration, human spaceflight systems and operations, and launch vehicles provides a critical foundation for NASA's human spaceflight programs. Orion, the next step in human spaceflight. <laughs>